suffer from chronic memory loss problems. I know I do. So what's the solution? Obviously it's more memory. The easiest way to install memory is to watch somebody else do it and then just do what they do. I'm Sherman. I work for memory10.net, Earth's largest memory store. I'm here to show you how to put it in and to direct you to memory10 to go and get your memory. So let's get started. Today we'll be replacing 512 megs of RAM in this Mirador Macintosh with another 512 megs of RAM just to show you how it's done. This particular machine has four memory slots. Each one can hold 512 megs. So the total amount you can get in this machine is two gigabytes, but today we're only, only gonna replace 512 megs and that, that particular memory comes courtesy of Memory10. Thank you, Memory10. On this particular model, you pull this little plastic tab right here and be careful not to let it drop, but the entire module, just the entire computer just opens right up, exposing all the insides. Take your wrist strap and attach it to a piece of metal, grounding yourself to the machine, saving your memory. If you don't have a wrist strap, no problem. Just rub your hand on the inside somewhere on the metal, on the power supply, and that will also ground you, and this will prevent your memory from uh, static discharge, probably ruining it. First thing we want to do is take it out, and to take it out, you'll notice on these memory slots, each of them has little levers on both sides of the slots which lock the memory in. We want to loosen up the slot or loosen up the little levers that releases the memory and then we can take it out. So I'll start with the one closest to me and see it's just a little gentle push with the tool. Doesn't take a lot of force. And doing that also lifts the memory up slightly so it's much easier to take out. The way to take it out is just to grab one corner and very gently give it a little tug, pull it straight up, memory comes right out, and then you just set it down out of the way. Now we'll go ahead and install our new memory. You take your memory, and of course you have yourself connected to a wrist strap, you're grounded to your machine so your memory is safe. What you want to do first is make sure you match the slots. See this little slot right in the, in the memory, right in the middle? There's a slot also, or there's a little piece of plastic right in the memory slot, hard for the camera that that fits right into. And you want to make sure you match them up. It's fair to do. Um, easiest way to install the memory is to start one end in, and I'm going to put for me the far end in first. Put it in and very gently lower the card, the memory card down so that it's on top of the slot. And then with both hands, give it a little push. And when you do that, you'll notice that the levers move up and lock your memory in. You want to make sure that the memory, uh, the, the lever on this side, on the one closest to you, is pushed up and the one farthest away are all pushed up. Now you'll know, or now you'll notice the memory is inside the machine, locked. You're ready to go, install your other ones, and that's all it takes. Thank you so much for watching this memory installation video. I hope you've had fun watching it. I know I've had fun making it. Please come visit us at memory10.net, www.memory10.net.